be fair, um, got nothing to lose, so I'll roll the dice again and see what happens. So. Uh, I'm okay, I'm a bit nervous, but I think that's expected. Yeah, no, I don't know, I'm kind of nervous, a bit apprehensive as well, but I'm excited. So. This is to launch Microsoft's Venture um, Explorer 8, um, and we're looking at um, really a good use of the web to promote either a creative idea or a business idea or something which might be, in the widest sense, altruistic and help other people. This is a celebration of entrepreneurship, and so we're judging three different criteria, three different groups um, for a young entrepreneurs competition, entrepreneurs between the age of 18 and 25, and they are getting prizes of £10,000 and a laptop each um, for the winners of each of the three categories. Good afternoon, uh, my name is Charles. Um, we're all here today because we've had education opportunities. We work for a community interest company called Stride Now and we're working on a youth focused project called Follow My Leader. My name's Abby Hinton and I would like to introduce to you my skills coaching idea which is the Offside Project. We launched this initiative because the most important thing that people do when they use their computer is they use their browser as a way to be able to go explore. And for us, that was really important for us. And we started thinking about how can we work with young kids today and think about what it is that they want to go out and explore. With your help, I want to see 25 young people run for local government in 2014 that otherwise would never have considered doing so. Thanks so much for your time very hard to make decisions. I think out of 268, you should all feel very proud, 268 entries. So in the case of adventure, the person that we have chosen is Luke Duggleby. I would like to uh, provide you the certificate as our first winner. To win the money at the moment, it means the world because it means the potential to finish a project that we started a long time ago and to finally instill what we've, uh, all the belief that we've given to the people in Uganda where we've been working. So the second, which is um, really around the online venture, it was a very, very tricky decision, but we decided um, that we would choose Rowena Davis. For the last one, the Creativity Explorer. Um, this again was tricky. With this one, we have um, decided to choose Nick Palfrey. It feels absolutely amazing to have won the uh, Internet Explorer Life Academy 2010. Uh, really excited, also very surprised. Uh, it's a great result for me in, uh, in MUFU and I'm just really happy that we'll be able to invest some, uh, some really good funds into uh, marketing our technology. A large part of it is just going to be spent on me being able to go around and actually talk to people, make some links with communities, schools, um, school packs, uh, like local government places, like whoever we need to get involved to get engaged. And then the rest is going to be on the website, some web, some cameras for people, so they can actually film what they're doing as they're going along. It's been it's been a really in, enjoyable day today, judging all the all the candidates. Um, I've really loved discussing their ideas with the panel. The panel has been brilliant. Um, everyone's been really enthusiastic, receptive to questions, really good answers. I've, I've been really impressed with how well thought through their ideas are and how far they've, they've got with no funding so far. So I, I look forward to finding out how they get on with, once they've had the £10,000 For anyone that's thinking of applying next year, I think it's a really good opportunity to see uh, more people with similar ideas to yourself and uh, to gain more experience and to get a lot of input actually from a lot of the judges is quite useful.